What's up everybody? This is Alyssa, CEO of Luminescent Dreams Web Design, and today I'm so excited to bring you an all new tutorial video. Teaching you the easiest way to create vertical text in Squarespace with no code. So I don't know about you, but I've tried creating vertical text in my clients' websites with code multiple times, with different methods, following different tutorial videos, and none of them have worked consistently, especially on mobile view. And sometimes like things start scaling really weird or it just causes like glitchy issues. And I came up with my own solution. It's super simple. You just create a graphic on Canva with the text, upload that to your website and format it however you like to fit the style of your layout. So let's just jump right in. I'll teach you my exact process for this. And I even have a little Canva template of some text that you can use as a starting point when you go about this process too. All right, so check this out. This is what you're gonna be creating today. Some nice vertical text. This is what I designed for my friend Haley's website. And the vertical text just makes this site so much more dynamic and interesting. It looks great on mobile view. And I also have two different font pairings. Um, this is the Horizon font and an outline version of the Horizon font as well, which I won't get into in this particular tutorial video, but I'll record another one at a later date um, that talks about how to set all of that up. I wanted to mention before we dive in, in order to make this work for your website, you will need Squarespace 7.1 Fluid Engine as your editor, and you'll also need a Canva account or subscription you can do this on the free version if you save the text with like a background color, but I recommend saving it with a transparent background and using Canva Pro if possible. First things first, I've created a nice little Canva template for you to utilize for your vertical text. And if you click the link down at the bottom of the video in the notes, you'll find this nice little Canva template. You can use it for a new design and Right here, you'll see, I believe it's a 12 by, yeah, two by 12 inch sized Canva file, but you can change the dimensions and customize everything to fit the needs of your particular website project. So you could either just double click on the words here and customize it to your needs. My website title, hello there. <laughs> and yeah, scale things as needed to fit the proportions. From here, also, you could just click on text and change the font. Um, or if you wanted to just start from scratch, like say with a white background and choose one of your brand fonts in Canva, for example, I have the Seasons Light here, you could just type something in here um, stretch the text out and then rotate it 90 degrees and scale it however you want. Um, but yeah, the benefit of starting with this is that it's already in there um, for you to customize. For now, I'm just going to go with this, uh, my website title, hello there text, and make sure to name your file if you want. Go up to share, download, PNG. I always like to save it as like at least two times, sometimes even three times the size, just so that it, the quality comes out really nice um, and it doesn't pixelate your text at all. And check transparent background if you have Canva Pro. And once you've downloaded that PNG file, you can upload it onto your Squarespace website. All right, so what I've done here is I've made a duplicate of this section of the homepage, but I just removed the vertical text so you can watch me upload it. I'm gonna to go to add block, image, upload file, and select the vertical text that I just saved as a nice PNG file. And when it first uploads, it might be super small. So you'll just need to drag and drop it around. Another trick too, um, just make sure it's set to fit and not fill. Cause if it's set to fill, it might crop um, some of the text around the margins there. So I did fit and I'm just going to expand it, make it a little bit bigger. 
and I'll just justify it to the right so that it um, yeah, aligns nicely with this image here. And make sure to double check the mobile view as well. So yeah, again here, you'll need to adjust this vertical text. And yeah, looks super sweet. Yay, what do you think? And also since this is like an image of your text and it's not the text itself, I recommend just making sure to add alt image text, um, identifying whatever the text that's written is there so that if a screen reader were reading your website and picking up on it, um, you would still be communicating clearly what it's saying in that part of your website. So that about wraps up this video. If you really liked it, feel free to like and subscribe to my channel, make any comments or additional notes or questions that you have as you're integrating some vertical text into your website. Also feel free to drop a link to your website and let us all know what you created with vertical text. I can't wait to see some epic new designs out there utilizing some of these tips and techniques. Again, my name is Alyssa. I'm the CEO of Luminescent Dreams Web Design. I do custom websites as well as one hour and four hour website work sessions. If you ever need me to hop in, make edits to your website, or you have questions that you'd like me to answer um, for you if you ever need some help. Thanks so much for tuning in. Bye for now.